Paris new tactician. It was you all along, wasn't the vision. Me, I'm still traveling in pursuit of knowledge. I never outstripped my tutor, but I'm getting a bit closer. Well, vision, tell me, what do you need me to do? And we're back. We're back in Fire Emblem. Hello, guys. How are you doing today? Welcome to another episode of Fire Emblem. It's been a while. I have probably edited a preview for this from previously on Fire Emblem, which I'm planning to do. But if you uh, just came from that, then this thing is, you know, what I'm saying here is, uh, you know. Obsolete! Yes, that's what I was looking for. How have you guys been doing? Uh, I've been doing not so great, but whatever. You know, stuff always happens. Uh, let's see, I'm going to... Oh well, you can actually move along with the rest of the band. For, yeah, for Marcus and for Loen, this is probably the last time uh, that they are going to be in battle. And probably also for Dorcas, but I'm don't know for sure. Probably, most likely. But what we want to do is get over to Lindis, who is actually over here. Now, if you have Lorena, which I'm going to train, you should probably, you know, get her out of range of uh, archers. And if you want, you can train Kendall Sane in these uh, chapters. It's nice. For, uh, here's a nice area now to train uh, Kendall Sane. Or Kent or Sane or whichever you want, whichever you choose, it doesn't really matter. I've been getting out a bit out of commentary with me not commentating for a while. After you know Shadow Colossus, I only did Shadow Colossus since I want to finish that LP. But now I finally finished that LP, and now we can finally move on to Fire Emblem. Yes, and I'm probably going to do a bit more uh, of. Fire Emblem um, than I usually than I usually do. I'm going to upload a, um, Fire Emblem a bit more. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I'm been pretty uh, you know off on uh, uploading, actually uploading uh, Fire Emblem or actually recording Fire Emblem actually because I didn't you know felt I didn't feel like recording Fire Emblem for a while. So yeah, that's basically all I have to say about that. Why don't why I uh, make it so? Yeah, I'm really really out of out of commentary wise. Also, I need to clean my room. Not that it's <laughs> any of your indication, but yeah. Why I say that's because there are flies in my room and they're annoying me. They're annoying my my vision. Yes, they're annoying the vision of chaos vision. Yes, the irony. And everyone knows if there are fly flies in your room. Well, then you need to clean it. Urk, can you do something please? Yes, you can kill him. So maybe, yeah, I, I'm actually going to train uh, Will for, uh, for this let's play. I usually train Rebecca. Rebecca is very good, but since I want to get a deviate a bit in this let's play. I don't dev deviate that much. I usually train Guy and uh, this time I'm going to train Raven. Which Raven is a overpowered character basically. That's why I usually never use him because you know I don't like using overpowered characters. Also I'm going to try and train Machu as much as possible since Machu is a uh, a very a character that you will need in the in the future now he's very uh, dependable and he's very useful and he's much yeah dependable whatever I don't know the word I'm looking for that's that's something right I don't know if you um, have a problem with sometimes when you're speaking a foreign language like I am speaking English to you guys which is for me is a foreign language you have sometimes, you know, troubles finding a certain word you're looking for. Because I do, because, yeah, you know. Sometimes, sometimes you get a critical hit from Sane with a 2% critical percent. 
percentage. Whatever, and he levels up. Do -do -do -do, level 8. I don't know if I'm going to train Ken the Sane. It wasn't my intention on training Ken the Sane, but maybe I will, you know. You, you can only use 12 cha cha characters in the end of the, 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 of the end uh, map, but it doesn't mean you cannot train more than that, you know. Getting them to level, you know, 40 or whatever isn't really that hard if you uh, abuse uh, training, abuse uh, something called the arena. Which I am going to show you uh, in, a, in a bonus video, which will be relatively soon actually. And there should be also a bonus video from Shadow Classes. I don't know when it will be up, but it will be up somewhere. Also, I'm planning my next project. Yes, I'm actually planning my next project. Which is something... I don't know how people will... I will... Normally, I am really, you know, a silent type. And I uh, like to be you know, legit in my video views. And uh, try not to, you know, um, to get myself out there, like, uh, you know, pour out my videos that uh, people call it, you know, say from, Hey, you, check out my video, it's super amazing. Yeah, I'm normally not like that at all. But I am going to do some, yeah, I'm going to do that for my next um, LP. You, you, no, you, you, not kill him. Can you please miss? Ah, oh, of course you don't miss. Of course you don't miss, but you do level up, and that is good. Level six Mordon. The guy is a uh, is a good character, but he is very uh, luck based. You know, he can turn out really good or really, yeah, really bad. Like Farina. Farina can also be pretty fragile. She is always fragile, but, you know, she can also, she can be pretty good. But I'm not having uh, as much luck as I I'd usually have with her. Usually her stats are a bit higher than I, uh, than I have now, but, look, well, but who cares, really? You know? So let me see. I'm not really explaining what to do, but um, if you try and follow my strategy, you know, if you're one of those people that tries to follow someone's strategy and try to, uh, you know, do, a, do something similar as they are doing, that doesn't work, you know, that never works. Not in, at least not in this game, it doesn't work. Because not only uh, every time, you know, every time you play this game, it's different. Not only because of that, but also because, you know, um, I'm not that good of a, a, of a strategist. So you, my advice is, um, do not follow me. Yeah, make up your own strategies. I am just one from uh, for uh, if he if he can kill it then he can kill it and then they die and so on and um, I usually think a bit ahead but I am not a master of the uh, strategy. We get a heavy spear. Huh. So we can move from here. Where can you move? Just there. Where can you move? Just there. Kellen, you can move in with. Oh, you don't. You still have mana caddy. Oh yeah, that's one thing. You get a if you used up the mana caddy from uh, from the old version, you get a new one in this. In this, you get a a, a a brand new one. That's what I want to say. A brand new blade. A brand new mana caddy. So it doesn't matter how much you used it in the uh, in the little story. You still always get a new one here. As you can see, people are moving towards me. And that's not something that we really want. But we can kill them all anyways. So I don't really care. 
I can ma maybe settle in this way. I don't need Lynn in this chapter. Actually, you can uh, just talk to everyone, you know. Go with uh, with with, with Rina and talk to Lynn. May end up doing that, but you know, they will get to each other eventually, so I'm not too worried about that. I don't know how long this episode will be. This is probably a long. This is a long chapter, so I don't know how long I will make this uh, episode. Episode, yes, that's what you call a part of a let's play, and I didn't want you to critical hit there, but whatever. Stealing all the experience for yourself, Lowen. Bad, Cavalier. Bad. Not really. But no. You can. Twelve. You. What do you, you do? Twelve. Okay. There we go. You still haven't leveled up, Bartray. Well, we need to do something about that. But well, we'll do that in the, in the next turn. Because hopefully the the archer will now come towards me and Oswin levels up. I, m I, may I must admit that Oswin is probably, um, if I uh, I, cho I chose him to, to you know, train, but he's probably uh, the one that, that will give me the most trouble in this, uh, in this run. So let me heal you. Since there is a, a way, you know, to train uh, units, but Oswin is probably the, the, the character that's the most difficult to train that way. Yeah. Basically, you can train everyone the way you want them to, and then there's a cheap way, cheap way to train, and it's even cheaper if you uh, can abuse safe states. So, yeah. That's all I have to say about that. You uh, can move here and uh, kill these uh, dudes over here. Probably. Marcus, you're the, that's the only use I have for Marcus in this chapter, by the way. To uh, protect uh, Molinus from uh, dying. Because I am going to train Molinus in this run as well. Which is not something I would recommend for first time players. Or anyone who's watching my strategies. Basically, my strategies come from uh, knowing, the, knowing the map really well. And that's all there is to it. You. You can hit him, right? Right? Yes, you can! Good! Good Hector! Good Hector! I didn't know I had the wolf bear still, still equipped, but I don't care, you killed him anyway. And you grew a level! Oh, by the way, if you're training lords, you might want to train Hector at last. Not because he's so weak, but because he's so strong. Yeah, think about that. Uh, is this an armory? No, a vendor. Oh, whatever, I don't care. You sell that. Thank you. Uh, Sane and Kent, you can move over to uh, the fray. Rebecca. Actually, can you? You can kill him, right? Right. Don't want you to kill him, but whatever. I don't care. And he levels up. Actually, Bartray still needs to level up. I, I forgot about that, but whatever. Yeah, Elwood and Lynn are probably the first choices to uh, in the in which you want to level them up. To uh, let uh, Hector stay in front of uh, Osman stay in front of Hector. I want, to, I want to say it the other way around, but no, it's not, I, I wanted to to mess up my recordings. No, <laughs> no, I can't. Uh, you, you can. You Yeah, what I'm trying to do is uh, have Sarah and uh, Hector have support when he, uh, not sec Sarah with Urk and Hector and Oswin have support with each other because that's what I want to do. 
for the let's play. You know, support are not important, but I don't care. Huh. You missed me, and I will appear at you with my mighty lance. Thank you. Go die in a hole. Now I knew this one was going to be here, but actually I want to buy a sword. Okay, whatever. I cannot uh, trade, apparently. You, can you kill him? No, apparently you can't. But I wanted you to kill him. No, apparently you can't. Good job, Will. Good job. As my, my, my esteemed archer, you're doing a very fantastic job in missing. And you too, Bartry. You're doing... Wait, how did you miss with a 73% chance of hitting? How did you miss? Erp? Please show them how it's done. Please show them how it's done. Thank you. Erp, at least you, on you I can depend. Actually, no, I cannot. <laughs> why did I say that? Well, the same reason why there was no voice actor for the part of Earth in that little thing. Yeah, I'm not going to talk about it, since we're going on to his guy. Was that a smart move to do? Because I think Sarah is now in the way of the uh, enemy harm. Never can put her out of enemy harm. Like so. By defeating another dude with Osman. You, uh... Actually no, apparently actually is no. I don't know what I'm saying here. <laughs> you, you can probably hit him, and you can probably miss, or no damage at all. Do no damage at all. Probably that wasn't all too smart of a move, but whatever, I don't care. Sword. Match you. Okay. No, that's not a smart move to do. Because, you know. Because you have to think, you know? Think about what you're doing. You can probably go up here. And you can probably also go up here. And that's what my commentary has been down to. And I didn't know that I was saying, you go down here, you go down there, and here, there, everywhere, Lin will defeat the bandit with ease. And the purple hit. Thank you, Lin! And goodbye. No, it's not the end of the episode, but I just said goodbye to the bandit. And you, thank you for defeating Lowen first before anything else. Thank you for that, because now we can move on. And at least these idiots won't kill Lowen. At least I take not. At least I hope not. Ooh, it's going to be close one, you know. You. No, 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 no. Okay, whatever. Uh, Night of Fairy was never fought. I said I was going to do a do no casualty run. Well, apparently... Nope. <laughs> Since I'm not going to start this recording again. Nope. I don't need Lowen anyway. For anything, actually. He was going to get the bench eventually anyway. So... I'm sorry if you really like Lowen. I don't. I don't really care for him. He got the bench. Yeah, that's basically it. He got the bench. And we're probably getting a special dialogue at, at the end of this uh, stage saying that uh, Lo Lowen is out of custody. I was going to do a no casualty run, but I don't really care for Lowen, so. could go back and save Lowen, 
But I'm not. You. So really, you're going to be a patient supreme, you know that? I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. Even I know, and I chose it. That's how the cookie crumbles. That's how the cookie crumbles. I don't really know. I'm I'm watching you know Gnome Shark LPs and uh, Pablo LPs. I know Gnome Shark isn't called Gnome Shark LPs. It's just called Gnome Shark. Whatever. I don't care. But I'm watching Gnome Shark and Pablo LPs, and it's really you know you have to really get into it. You know, Pong. Walker is the only enemy left. We're going to defeat him. We're going to kick his ass. Actually, I think Hector can do that all by himself. But whatever. And I'm actually, you know, not going to. You can talk to uh, with Lynn, with to Elliot, to Hector, and to Florina. And I believe you can talk with. Uh, can't wait um, to Hollywood, no? No, apparently not. Uh, you, I'm going to train you. You, I'm going to do that. Um, you, I want you here. Uh, you, I don't care. You to fly towards the land. Thank you. I want you. Uh, I don't want. You. I want you out of the way. And I want you. And I don't care about you guys. You can. You can get through it in the next episode. And that's it. So basically, if you don't know what I'm going to do, is I'm going to support. And that's basically all I'm going to do in this episode. And let's see, you only have one with Hector, but I need to move you a bit out of the way so you're not in contact with Hector or in Hector's uh, moving zone. So I'm going to do support and I will be back until, you know, until the supports, you know, are done. Actually, there will be here two enemies and they will spawn, you know, Two more will spawn and they will try to attack Molinas as well as Marcus. But you shouldn't actually focus any troubles. There, there wouldn't be any problem if you could just keep Marcus on them. And I will see you guys in a in a bit. Actually I can talk to you know, Farina and before I cut anything out, I'm going to do that. Yeah, sorry I said I was going to cut it out before you know and then uh, check the time but I'm going to talk with Florina talk. Florina did you learn this? you're unharmed I'm so relieved really was my service at all helpful? of course it was you say it off thank you Tee -hee. I'll do even better next time I'm counting on it yeah I find a little bit there but I will see you guys in a bit and we're back. Before we do this, however, you may want to go to into uh, the armory and uh, you know buy some swords and go into uh, the shop here and buy a heal for uh, Sarah because you may need it, you know, in the future. I can see the future. Now I'm going to prepare to f fall before your master. I'm going to train Oswin and he already has a critical hit and that is lucky but uh, if you hear that there's people going to the bathroom and such uh, he won't uh, you know kill him you know since now he can get another turn and yeah Oswin misses for example so that yeah stuff like that happens you know a lot the, the fact that I got the critical hit is actually uh, 
very uh, convenient. But whatever, I can also buy a fire. Maybe one more hill. And we sent them to Molinas. Now, if you want to know, she she is a real bitch to get uh, support with. And I'm going to put on screen the number of uh, turns it will take for me to get her to support. Right now I already have her, you know, uh, the first level. So I uh, will put down the, the number that of turns I need to wait for her first level uh, support. Basically that's what I'm going to do. Now the reason I want to train Oswald in here is uh, because, well, I can train everyone else who I want to train, basically in a chapter coming up ahead. And, uh, and there are enough chapters, you know, to train other ch uh, other uh, units. There are enough, uh, you have enough time to train your units, but I'm also, a bit, oh, I'm always a bit, you know, uh, What's the word? Anxious? Yeah. A bit nervous or something that I uh, that I won't make it, you know. That I won't class them up, you know, before time. For for example, lords uh, need to be a certain level before a certain chap chap chapter. And this is the the. The tr this is the end of the, the episode. I'm going to not read this, these lines. I'm going to read these lines in the next episode. So I hope to enjoy uh, you enjoyed this little episode. I don't know how long I will make it, depending on editing and such. But I will see you in the next episode. Until.